This video is intended for ages 13 and up. Hello friends and welcome to Let's Play Obama and the Ghost of Michael. I'm your host, Magic Man Mo. Evil Scrunch, some kind of bad Santa, has kidnapped old Santa Claus to end Christmas on Earth. Obama receives the visit of the Ghost of Michael, who asks him for a help to rescue Santa! Scrunch's hideout is located somewhere in Neverworld! A world of fantasy and mystery! This is a point-and-click adventure game from Inca Games, and this is Inca Games Round 2 The Incaning, where I'm playing through all of the Inca Games games that I've played before for the second time. Again. We're playing them all again. And apparently this is a Christmas episode, so you know what that means? It means Christmas hat. It's a little early. It's not quite December yet. We're still rocking November, but this, that's no reason I can't rock a, a Christmas cap. That's what we're doing today. If you've never seen these types of games before, you'll figure it out. It's a point-and-click adventure game. You point and you click and you adventure. <laughs> if, you, if you have seen this, you know what we're in for. I'm already digging the hat. I'm already looking forward to December when I'm wearing this hat in every single episode. It'll be this one. It's a nice one. You like it? You like the look? It's pretty good. I look like I'm an elf and I belong in a, in a workshop. Working some wood! <laughs> Tonight is Christmas. Luckily I already got the presents for Sasha and the rest of my family. Well, let's get back to work. I have a lot, uh, a lot to do for, for world peace and the such. What? <laughs> Obama, I hope I didn't scare you. Uh, uh, who, who are you? Seems like you can't recognize me. I'll show you who I am. Sure, sure, we'll do like Thriller on Christmas. Sure, that's the one dance he's known for. That's it. Michael, I can't believe it. That's right, Obama. I need your help so I can rest in peace. Santa Claus has been kidnapped by Scrunch, some kind of evil Santa who hates Christmas. My soul won't rest in peace if Christmas doesn't come for all and the children in the world. Don't worry, Michael. I'll rescue him. Thanks, Obama. I'll take you to Netherworld, where you'll start this mission. Fwop. Evil Scrunch is gonna pay as opposed to good Scrunch, who won't be pegged. We have to get to Scrunch's hideout and rescue Santa. But first, it's banana time! <laughs> Peanut butter, jelly, and peanut- It's not ban banana time, but you know, the little banana that sings peanut butter jelly time. Peanut butter jelly! Uh, we got an elephant. Can I put the elephant in my pocket? That would have been amazing. Can I take the, to put the giraffe in my- Now, re a reminder, I will remind you that I have played this game before, but God, has it been a long, long time, so I don't remember how it all works. I think that monkey throws something at my head and kills me when I pick this up. No? Maybe not. Maybe, I, I, I feel like the monkey hurts me. Somehow. Maybe can I, can I speak to the monkey? I can speak to the monkey! Hi, hey, little monkey. I lost a key, and I wonder if you've seen it. And I do clearly see that it's in your hand. Oh, he just he just laughs at me. He doesn't murder me. He just laughs at me. Okay, excellent. Now, can we speak in a civilized fashion without pointing and laughing, and perhaps we can come to an agreement of some- Oh, that monkey is asking for it! I'm about to get violent! <laughs> Obama, um, Nobel Peace Prize winner, I'm about to get violent! I'll buy the key from you. I've got a banana. I actually do have a banana, though. Can we actually just offer the banana? Come here, little monkey, and I'll give you this nice banana, yeah? No? Mm, the monkey's not hungry. I'm going to make him hungry somehow, some way. I do have a Neverworld map. Oh, excellent. We, we just, it's a straight line. We're going to go from the crazy zoo to the funny park to the moon and then to the docks for some reason and then continue on into the scrunch death mountain, the Zelda style death mountain. Can I just throw the flower pot at him? Just chuck it at him? No. I've got some pepper. Can I make it the elephant sneeze? Yes, we're gonna make the elephant sneeze, and that's gonna like scare the giraffe. Oh, it's gonna blow the giraffe closer to the monkey. Ooh, looks like the poor elephant got a cold. Nyum, nyum, nyum. That's not a, that's not what happened at all, Obama. You were here for that. You know better. Uh, that wouldn't be polite. Well, can we uh, anti-villain Christmas spray? I think we're gonna need that for scrunch. Can I eat the banana? That would be pretty good. I, I want to like climb the giraffe. Is that not something I can do? Can I flower pot the giraffe? Yes. 
Oh, he's gonna eat the flower pot. Oh, I was I was still like, I should like throw the flower pot. Hey, monkey, finally, we're face to face. Uh, give, give me that key. I'll do what must be done. I'm going to strangle Obama, Nobel Peace Prize winner, strangles monkey. That would be a great headline in a newspaper. All right, we're gonna pick up the key. That would be a great headline. That would be such a fantastic headline. I would read that article. Can I pick the pot back up now? Nah. That monkey is literally traumatized. Like, we, we did a very bad, we just did a very bad thing. Like, this is traumatizing. That's more like it. All right, I'm gonna go forward. I see that there is a kitty cat on this, a mischievous kitten on top of this Ferris wheel. Can we, can we reach the kitten? I kind of want to have the kitten. It's jammed. I can't move it. Well, perhaps there's a way to acquire the kitten anyway. Well, there's a springboard trampoline of some kind. All right, we got a springboard. Can I do something with the stall? I don't want troubles. We don't want trouble. Oh, maybe we'd speak to the stall. There we go. We'd speak to it. Good afternoon. I'd like a strawberry cake, please. I am the president of the United States of America. I mean, at the time that this came out. We don't sell food here. Hmm, my mistake. Uh, good afternoon. Do you sell any chips? Yeah, we sell chips here. Hey, chips are food. You said you don't sell food. I'd like one chip, please. I'm in my break, so I can't sell you anything. Come on, man. I just want one. One, just one. Oh, Louie, come back in an hour. Whatever, I don't like you anyway. All right, well, let's, can we springboard this cat situation? I don't think we can. I don't think we really have anything to help with the cat at the moment. Can we get in the space rocket? I don't want to take it with me. I do. A coin box. Oh, we don't have a coin. Take it with me, not a chance. How do we acquire a coin? Can I... Anti-villain spray. Look, we don't have a lot of options. <laughs> We don't have a lot going on for it. Like, I got nowhere else I can go. I can go back, but there's nothing here. I mean, there's this thing. Can I put a banana in the hole? I mean, that monkey could have had my banana. And he, he really missed his opportunity there. He really, can I pepper this guy? How about, look, there aren't a lot of options available to me. It's gotta be like, can I use the banana grease to open the lever? It's gotta be the springboard, right? gotta be no okay well what a <laughs> what a predicament we find ourselves in can I get it hmm, I'd love to ride it but I have to rescue Santa oh there's an item literally behind this rocket oh, okay oil oh of course oh the old trick of the hidden oil oh yes now now we can pull the pull the lever crunk I mean Obama there we go. Give me that cat. Give me the. Give me the cat. The kitten has such a peculiar necklace. Oh, a necklace. Oh, a coin for a necklace. I can put the coin in the little coin box. And we're gonna. The door open. Now we're just gonna ride this coin operated rocket to the moon to infinity and beyond. There we go. Oh, and it's an alien. And we're gonna suffocate out here, aren't we? Is there air? Are we gonna die? No, we can breathe up here. There's air on the moon. NASA, they lied to us. Can we speak to the moon citizen? Hey, moon citizen. Greetings, my friend. Hello, Obama. Uh, how do you know my name? We are updated of what happens on your planet. We know you have been awarded for contributing to peace in your planet and also strangling a monkey. The whole universe is hoping for peace on Earth. I hope you won't let us down. Don't worry, my friend. I'll do the impossible to achieve world peace. Oh, man. Playing this in a post-Obama presidency. Whew. <laughs> anyway, uh, is there anything else we can talk about? Uh, greetings. Do you know who Michael Jackson is? Of course, the one you call the king of pop. His music is heard across the universe. I love the way he dances, especially the moonwalk. Uh, uh, would you like a demonstration of the moonwalk? I'd love to. Oh, it's gonna happen. It's happening. Obama's gonna Obama walk. This shouldn't even surprise, like, like shock him. Like, you're on the moon. You should know all about this. You've made my day, so I'm gonna give you a present. Years ago, I visited your planet and got to film a little dinosaur. 
I give you this hollow projector so you can see what I filmed. Just place it in the ground and it will work. Oh, uh, thank you. It's a strange gift, but I'll take it. Thank you very much. I'm glad that you, you just keep this on you forever. Can I take the flag with me? Take it with me? No way! <laughs> oh man, I wanted to take the flag with me. No! Okay, well, we don't need it, I don't think. I really don't think we need it for anything. So long, my friend, and thank you for everything. So long, my friend, and thanks for all the fish. Goodbye, Obama. Good luck. And we're back home. And I can move on now all of a sudden. I don't know if there's anything else I can do with this guy in the stall. I don't think so. Uh, I, I don't know. I don't know if there's anything I, I do with him if I come back and get my chip from him one day. I don't know. It's a pirate ship. Uh, there's a circle here. Do I put the hollow projector here? Do I put the cat here? There's some uh, springboard. Ah, oh, we gotta get onto the ship, but of course. But of course. It's too high to climb the ship. Yeah, 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 yeah. All right, is there any other item that I can pick up before I get on the ship? I think we're gonna springboard. Doing? And I'm in. <gasps> Yoshi! I think I need a Yoshi? Do I need a Yoshi for this? Can I kit in your face? Uh, banana peel. Yes, we must make you fall. I'm guessing we need a Yoshi. Can I like- oh, I can! <laughs> and in two day, trying to steal my treasures, you'll pay! Excuse me, I think this was a misunderstanding. I want to talk. Nonsense, you'll walk the boat! No one can defeat Captain Crook! Uh, I think someone can. Can we evil villain spray him? No. I, I can't even- can I even leave? Like, I'm here now. Can I even- like, I can't even get off the ship. Like, we're- like, this is happening. One way or the other, I feel like it's it's gotta be the hollow projector, right? I feel like I feel like it's the hollow projector. Um I literally can't leave, even if I wanted to. Like there's no arrow. Like I, I can I can I sneak around him? Nope, nope, oh, oh, oh. Have we have we activated your gaze yet? Oh! Oh, I'm doing something! Oh, I knew it was the projector! I knew it was! I don't know why it wasn't working before- Yes! Big dinosaur! Spook him! Spook him! And he's gone. There we go. I knew it was the dinosaur, because Yoshi's a dinosaur. He sure got scared. He must have thought it was a giant crocodile. <laughs> I don't even think that's supposed to be Yoshi. I think it's just supposed to be a dinosaur. But it looks like Yoshi to me! My Barack sense tells me it will be useful once in Chocolate Land. Oh, yes. The- 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 the Barack's- Sense. Now this ship has a new captain. Let's cross the chocolate river. Oh, we're literally riding the <laughs> We're literally riding the ship. Okay. I didn't even realize it was a chocolate river. I thought it was just mud. Is this how I just go? Oh, this goes to the chocolate fat. Oh. Oh. Well, we've got some sort of scarecrow here. Okay, and we've got a hole and some bush. I think I want to go pick up the bush and put it over the hole. Can I pick up the bush without getting eaten by the giant ferret? <laughs> a ferocious wolf. Can I put the bush on the hole? I'm gonna put the- Oh god, don't walk in front of him, you crazy man! It seems to be dinner time! <laughs> well, now try it again without walking in front of the- Yeah. A tricky bush. Um, can I, like, stand on the other side of it and yell at him? I better keep it quiet. No, I want him to run towards us and fall down. How can I put the kitten on the bush as bait? Can I bait the- the- the, the wolf? No, can I throw a banana at him? That would be pretty great. I feel like this is all the right stuff, but let's go check out the chocolate factory for now, and maybe we can come back. There's some chewing gum here. Can I go pick it up? This isn't like some sort of w weird pink goo. All right, we've got a, a chewing gum. I'm gonna chew that gum. My Barack sense tells me the gum will be useful later. Okay, well, if you say so, Barack, I will trust in your Barack sense. We've got ch chocolate factory, Mr. Wonky. Mr. Wonky, is there something you can do for me? Something I can do for you? Good afternoon, sir. What's good about it? Uh, a nice factory. Yeah, I think all you want from me is a favor. This is true. Me? A favor? Nah, of course not. I'm not in the mood for favors. I'm sorry. Well, can we keep, keep talking? Why are you so upset? Don't make me remember. I'm super upset and I don't want to remember. I just invented the greatest of all candies with the best flavor and fragrance ever imagined. I can't come up with a name for it. And I'm super upset. Maybe I can help you with that. You think you're smarter than me? Okay, let's see. Give me a name. Uh... Fru Fru. It's like Snoo Snoo, but with less, less Snoo. 
terrible name. I don't like it. What a genius you are. Well, I think what we need to do, as I seem to recall from playing this before, I need to use a telescope on this sign way over here. Chaco Wonky. Chaco Wonky sounds like a candy name. And I don't know how a sign was made with Chaco Wonky, and this guy can't even think of Chunk. Like, Chaco Wonky must already exist, right? For there to be a giant billboard sign of it? You would think, right? I don't know who we're about to plagiarize, but we're about to. Oh, okay, let's see. Uh, why are you so upset? Blah, 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 blah. Come up with a name Chaco Wonky. Terrible name. I don't like it. It sucks. Hmm, let's see. I have to come up with something. How about Jocko Wonky? Oh, I'm a genius! Oh, that! I'll call it Jocko Wonky! I love that name! I came up with it all by myself with no help! You have brought me luck, my friend! You have inspired me! I'm so happy I'll give you a candy to make your life happier! Thanks, Mr. Wonky, you're so kind! Uh, I'll take it. <laughs> I, I like to imagine he would just hold it out there for like ever just holding it forever like are, are you gonna take it? You're gonna take you're gonna do it. You're gonna take it. What's up? What are you doing? All right I think that's everything we can do here I still don't know quite what to do with the wolf, but maybe if I chew the gum now, maybe if I candy Yes, the candy. Oh, we all knew we all know that wolves love candy canes not kittens Seems like he loved candy. <laughs> I'm gonna enter the woods. Into the woods! Into the woods! That is a wise tree. I think there's a little more going on with this picture than just a wise tree. Can we speak to the wise tree? Or is he gonna eat us? Good day, sir. Good idea, my friend. What can I do for you? How old are you? Are you an ancient tree? All of them. Amazing. That doesn't answer my question, but you are so wise. Could you give me a present, please? I see that you have one. I'm, I'd gladly give you a present, but with the crow there, it's so very awkward to, to do so. Uh, don't worry, I'll, I'll move the crow for you. Can I take the stick? I shouldn't move the stick. I can put the scarecrow on the stick, yes! Excellent! Ah, my big brain! The scarecrow is useful after all. Well, we, I, did, I didn't ever say it wouldn't be. Can you give me that present, please? Of course. Thanks to you, I feel more... I fell more comfortable. I'll give you a present to play a prank on someone. The person who opens it will get an explosive surprise! <laughs> Thanks, I'm sure it will be useful. Somehow, some way, we'll make this happen. A dangerous gift. Ooh, the most dangerous gift of all. Uh, I don't think there's anything else I need to do here. I think that was all I needed. So I'm going to move on forward. Look, we're just barreling through all of this stuff. What is that? C Capone, oh, Capone Bar. There's a screwdriver here. Okay, excellent. Do I, will I immediately get... I feel like I'm going to immediately got, get shot to death if I go... Oh, I should get a gun first before I go into Capone Bar. Even Barack's like, we should probably go in armed. Nobel Peace Prize winner Obama. We should get a gun first. We got some wires here. Can I take the wires without electrocuting myself? A gangster car. Take it with me. I don't think so. I, I think so. I think so very much. I think it's Capone's car. Can we get into his car? Can we, like, screwdriver? Yes, screwdriver the car. Oh, excellent. Can I take, uh, I've got a, a battery. And what is this? Some sort of golf club? What, don't, don't give me sass. What is this? Oh, it's a machine gun. It looks like a golf club. I'm sorry. I think that's everything in there. I think the battery and wires go together. Maybe later. Maybe later. I think they do later. All right, let's get out of here. We've got our gun. I'm going in. I'm going in, Obama. How's your Barack senses feel? If you want to get into my bar, you must defeat my boys first. Foist. Foist, you must defeat my boys. So we can move the mouse over the villains and click to shoot them. Oh, God. Nobel Peace Prize winner Obama shoots gangsters in Capone Bar. Look, I'm not getting over this. this oh, oh, God. I have quite a bit of health, thankfully, because I am definitely getting shot to, to hack. These guys have so much health, but they're, they're, we're, getting, we're knocking them out. We're doing it. We're doing this is why I can't play shooters. Look at this reaction time. The clicks per minute on my on my crazy reaction time. Look at look at the look at me go oh god. I, I should ooh, ooh, I should probably like 
try a little harder, but I think we're almost there. I think we got him. I think we got him. Oh, good work, bar clear. We barely, we only took a few shots to the face. We barely got scratched. Finally, guys, from Inca Games, something, something, something. We got a jukebox, baby. I, see, I can put that in my pocket. I keep right clicking. I don't know what's wrong with me. We've got a record, baby. You spin me right round, right round like a record, baby. Thriller, thrill the night. All right, so we got all that stuff taken care of. Let's go out of here. I don't think we need to use any of that just yet, but we can move on forward to whatever the next room is. The cemetery. Oh, it's dark. Well, that was fast. That's one heck of a sundown. Also, there's a demon in front of me. The graveyard keeper. I think there's more going on here than just graveyard keep. Can we speak to him? Is he friendly? He looks like he's going to eat our soul. Hi, Mr. Keeper. Why are you so skinny? I'm not that skinny. It's the outfit. I don't think the outfit is the one to blame. Well, that's awfully rude of you, Obama. I didn't appreciate that. All right, that that actually did that literally went no. Why the long face? I feel lonely and depressed. I could use some company. I'd love to stay, but I have to save Santa. However, let me see what I can do for you. Oh, uh, maybe you'd like this kitten? Mr. Keeper, accept this kitten as a gesture of goodwill. I'll place it on top of your head. Just what I needed. A companion. Thank you very much. That was my good deed for the day. Now, can I get into the cemetery? I don't want trouble with the gravekeeper. I should... He should open the... F okay, maybe we, can, maybe we can convince him to open the gate. Could you open the fence for me? Or even the gate. The gate would be great. Um, it's the least I could do. Now that you have given me this lovely pet. Thanks. Oh, thank you very much. I'm going to head on inside. Oh, here we go. Oh, my God. Here it is. got to jukebox this. We're going we're gonna to have a graveyard smash. We're going to have a graveyard smash. It's going to be a graveyard bash. It's going to be a monster mash. It's not October, but it's also not December. It's November. So a little bit of Halloween, a little bit of Christmas, a little bit of in between. Thrill the night. I don't remember that worst thriller at all, but I hope you're ready to to enjoy it. Yeah. Get it. Oh yeah. Get it. Uh-huh. Oh yeah. Get it. <laughs> that was cool. I was expecting more music. It was actually very quiet. I was expecting it to be a lot louder. Uh, can I pick this stuff back up? Not a good idea. Let's leave it that position. I like how it's suddenly day. Like, has, has it been a whole day and night? It's been a whole day and night since we began this adventure. All right, what do we gotta do here? We gotta climb this cliff. I don't think I can climb it. Well, why the heck not? Maybe some chewing. <gasps> chewing. Oh, of course, we gotta blow a giant bubble and then just fly. <laughs> That's not scientifically sound, but sure, why not? I bet you didn't expect that. <laughs> I should have expected that. In fact, I kind of expected that. Uh, but that's Scrunch. He looks like the Grinch. Uh, can we talk? Can we just machine gun? <laughs> can we just machine gun Scrunch? I mean, come on. We got a dangerous gift. How about this? Yes! Open the most dangerous of gifts. Ooh, a surprise gift. I shall open it. I'm so excited. I've never gotten a present before. Uh-oh. And he's dust. You could say it was his first and last present. <laughs> we literally murdered a man. Obama, Nobel Peace Prize winner. Let's not waste more time. All right, we'll go inside. Was that not Scrunch? Oh, no, that's Scrunch. That must have literally been the Grinch. We finally meet Scrunch. Let Santa go. Never. I'm keeping this old fatty locked until people respect me. We'll see about that. Defeat Scrunch. Okay, we've got movement. we got A and S to move. And uh, the weapon is space bar. All right, here we go. Oh, we're, it's a fight. It's a fight. Oh, we got to use the evil villain spray. Of course. Of course, it's the evil villain spray. Yes. Oh, we got We got you now. Oh, Scrunch. Scrunch coming in hot. No, Scrunch. Okay, we got you. I'm going to get... Oh, God, no. He's too powerful. He's so quick. He's so agile. I, oh, God, no. Oh, this is a fight. This is a fight for the ages. Oh, Santa, I need your I need I need your aid. You need to use your magic, the, the magic of Christmas. 
You have to use the magical Christmas to help. There it is. We got Scrunch. We did it. We did the thing. And he's just gonna poof out. Ho, ho, ho. Thanks for rescuing me, friend. It was nothing, Santa. Wow, we sound very similar. Eh, just kinda. Michael! Thanks for helping me accomplish my mission, Obama. Now I can rest in peace. Yay! So long, my friends. Woo! Oh, yes, of course. Float on to heaven, big guy. Thank, thank you very much for helping me succeed in this adventure. If you enjoy this adventure, don't forget to visit IncaGames.com where you'll find many more. Stay in touch. We got Obama Escape from Guantanamo coming soon. See you next time. Okay, bye-bye. Alright, and that's been, of course, Obama and the Ghost of Michael. We just beat it for the second time. We just round to it. The Inconing has come for Obama and the Ghost of Michael. That's going to do it for this episode. If you enjoyed it, please do all the things. But what if you guys don't want to thank you all so much for watching. And until next time, wash your hands. Bye!